Weed of the Week is another tough perennial weed. It's honey vine milkweed. There are a number of factors that can make a weed very difficult to control. This one not only is a perennial, but it's also a vine. And when we run into both of those in the same plant, our options become limited quite quickly. Well, like we usually say with perennial weeds, we need something systemic, something that's going to get down and not just kill the top growth, but something that's going to get way down into the root system and kill it off completely. The best answer, just like with most weeds, it's Roundup. So if you have the opportunity to spray Roundup, then make sure you're using the highest labeled rate and you should be in pretty good shape. Here's the challenge though, Roundup's not great normally on vines. Now on this particular vine, it can work okay, but you gotta get it early. Once that plant starts vining out, now it's got growing points all over and many of them will be under the cover of your desirable plants. And that makes it tough to get product on them. So as Brian said, you've got to have a good strong dose to move through that plant. And the big thing here is to get to every one of those growing points. As you say that though, Darren, sometimes we'll see a whole patch that's out there and it's all connected. And there will also be some pieces that are below ground that don't even have a shoot yet. Well, that's the reason why we don't want to do tillage there before we spray the Roundup or Tordon or whatever it is that's systemic it's going to work through that plant. So try to avoid tillage in those areas. When you till, you actually many times make the problem worse. There's a little bit of debate out there about honey vine milkweed of should I use Sharpen in my burn down with the Roundup? Will the Sharpen burn the plant too fast that it won't take the Roundup in? I would say leave it out, but if all you're doing is a little bit of burn down, the weather isn't right for Roundup, you're not using a high rate of Roundup anyway, then sure, burn it down with something sharpened, dicamba, 2,4-D, anything like that would be fine. When we get into wheat, that is our best option, that burn down with, with Roundup or Roundup and Sharpen, because post-emerge, we don't have any really good answers no. other than maybe Husky might burn it back a little bit. In corn, we do have a good post-emerge answer. Status, although it's a little expensive, it does a pretty nice job if you can get the weed when it's small. Yep, and in soybeans, I would use a 2,4-D or dicamba tolerant bean if you don't want to use just a straight Roundup bean. So you need something else because in conventional beans, this is pretty tough to control. That's all the time we have for this week's weed, Honey Vine Milkweed, but Iron Talk is coming up next.